and and welcome so let's go to the next song what i'm saying bts is doing good quality music i'm talking about music's like rain like damn it <laughs> it's literally unbelievable so the next song is called can you turn off your phone okay look <laughs> look at Aram's face unbelievable talking straightly to their own friends and generation huh this photo is so funny with this song so what did you get from the song anyway you thought it's 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 telling you that you don't need to turn it off or you have to turn it off is it part of the so sarcasm can you turn off your phone or is part of the whole idea that you should turn off your phone People can read the lyric and have different perception, you know. 
You have to turn it off. Okay, anybody else? Anybody else would think it's just a, it's it's not a sarcasm or it or it is a sarcasm. Uh, they're saying when you meet up with friends you gotta keep the phone down. Yeah, cool. Very nice. So do you keep your phones down <laughs> when you meet a friend? <laughs> uh yeah. Do you? Like, yes, you should. Uh, typically, if I want to be super honest, I always leave my phone in the car when I meet a friend. I never carry my phone around because it's too much distraction. And whenever, even if, I, if, if, if my phone is with me, it's in my pocket. I never just bring it out to even check any notification or, or anything. When I say I want to meet a friend for an hour, I try to just be present at the moment and not checking anything like anything it, 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 even if somebody wants to talk to me they can talk after the one hour so if they call and if i answer the phone it's kind of like you know very not useful to me yes cool yes keep it, keeping it into your pocket is the best option and to some extent nowadays it's a it's a proof that if you just even put your phone on the table, it's a distraction because of the amount of noise that it can generate into your brain. That somebody is about to call you, somebody sent a message, and you eventually going to just pick your phone up and checking for any sort of notification. Even putting it on the f table, it clearly shows that you don't care about that person and you're not present at that moment. Unfortunately, everyone is on their phone, a scrolling conversation is becoming a non-existent. Yes, of course. Like everything should, should has a balance point that you just try to stay in that balance point and not going up or down. Not using your phone at all is going to be a problem nowadays. And using your phone too much, again, it's going to be a problem. So it should be some sort of, you know, whenever you need it, you bring it out. Whenever you don't need it, you do not bring it out. Like whenever you're with a friend, like you want it to be there, right? It's if somebody just, I don't know, accidentally I see somebody outside of home, which I don't want to talk on that particular moment, or I don't really care. I will have my phone with me, to be honest. It's like, dude, I mean, it's like it's an unwanted meeting. I don't have to commit to such meeting. But if I commit to my meetings if I want to go anywhere talking about anything with a girl on a date or with a friend outside of home on a regular meeting I do not use my phone at all I always keep it in my pocket I even do not bring it out and about the about my phone being silent I think it's been like five or six years that I have not heard any of my phones ringing because I hate it kind of so it's always in silent Yes, balance is very important. Like in in any in any stage of life, we should be able to um, know how to keep the balance. You know, otherwise you're gonna your your life is gonna be a mess. Criteria for a relationship has dr drastically changed now. It's social media status, etc. It's a very bad thing, of course. Uh, I am rarely on my phone when I am with someone. Yes, I am never on my phone when I'm with someone. Like, uh, I think the only moments that I use my phone when I'm with someone, it's in the car playing a song. That's all. Like, that's the most of the time that I, that's the most usage of me having my phone in my hands. Other than that, when I'm out of the car, I, I, I do not look at it for any reason because... Because I'm going to miss a lot of, you know, life lessons when, when I have my phone. The only time that I use my phone, I, 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 I do not exaggerate this. The only time that I use my phone is when, when my mom calls, my, my, when my brother calls. Like, these are the only time that I'm on my phone. And plus, the very, very end of the night, I use my phone around an hour. To just, you know, to, to watch other people's stream and to watch the YouTube content that I really like. Other than that, it's just always on the charger and I charge my phone every two or three days. 
not doing anything with it, literally. Yeah. But it's just good for communication. Like, it made everything a lot more easier. Without it, it's kind of, like, hard to communicate with your with your family. That's the only usage that phone has. Someone like me. Now everyone is holding their phones 24 hours and taking pictures and posting things to social media. Yeah, that's a way of living, but not a healthy one, I, I, I assume. <laughs> Uh, let me do something. Let me let me turn on uh, my backlight. Um, I'm missing them. Uh, and then we can go to the next song. Ironically, you focus on BTS with the phone, but they tell us turn off your phone. Our relationship with BTS is so funny. Uh, no, they're actually telling you to have balance while using your phone like yes you're 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 watching me maybe with your phone and we're consuming but you know we're we're we're, we're consuming information we're, we're we're doing some some sort of thing to be able to understand and you know but but apart from that um if you're just using it too much that's not very good yes